Hi everybody, it's Dr. Dan here at the Balancing Center and uh, today's video is going to follow up a video we did just recently about infants and how the challenges of getting out of the birth canal and the challenges of managing one's head and the challenges of having diapers, keeping the legs in a funny position and the falls and the traumas as they go through the process of becoming a toddler. So in the toddler stages, there's, there's lots of falling down, there's lots of bouncing on their butts, and they're really designed pretty well to weather the storm. But there's also a lot of reflexes that are supposed to be taking place in the early years, from the sucking reflex in the beginning to the cross-crawl patterns. And I see that some of the kids that fail to sort of develop normally um, somehow didn't crawl. People say, wow, you know, Johnny, you never crawled. You just got up and walked, which is great. But if they, he missed getting in some of these oppositional um, movements in the body, there's connections to the brain that he may need later if he wants to be doing sports or just to live a very connected, leveraged, resourced life. So there's also with the toddlers, they've got these big diapers on that kind of put their hips into external rotation. They're walking forward. And if they were damaged or injured in the upper cervical area or just other areas in their spine during the birth process and during falls, to keep them just put right back on the track, learn from that practice, not let it become the kid on the playground with it or running with one shoulder way higher than the other because that's just going to turn into a spinal curvature that when the hormones hit now we're moving out of another out of the toddler phase and through the child phase into the early adolescence and what we want to do is not have the body set up on a tilted base when they hit puberty and now it seems like young girls because a lot of the xenoestrogens and the parabens and all the other volatile toxins we're exposed to are hitting puberty at even earlier ages and also just the the connection with so much information in the in the community and in the environment so we know that toddlers fall a lot i can check them in five minutes dr ken is just a master at working with the kids too they all of a sudden come back to a place of ease. They get much more easy to handle. Their personalities come back because they're not locked in pain. And they don't know that it's pain. All they know is their system resources are being locked up. And we don't want them to grow like that. I know for myself, I would have a gripping pain in the upper part of my back and into my right shoulder blade. And I was pretty active. I took care of horses. And there were times I remember as I was cleaning at the barn, that I kind of had to psych myself up to get the next load of manure out because my back was hurting. And then I accidentally, after high school was over, got my first chiropractic adjustment. And then I realized what was going on with me my entire life. And I just knew that I wasn't necessarily wanting to do a lot of sports because my body already hurt and running into people on purpose and doing these countless laps around the gym just made my body hurt worse. So. I'm grateful that I had the experience that I had because I loved the being with the horses. I learned a lot about that. And the reason that the horses were good was it was not that linear kind of exercise. It was always a different little emergency that would make me stay present. So it adapted me for what I chose to do. It adapted me for the way I learn and the way I think. And so everything works out for the best. But toddlers with the diapers and falling with the early movement reflexes that we can make sure are just loading normally and when there's a trauma and they have fallen and hit their head sometimes the body that concussion locks in a response and then the body never sort of lets go and the shoulders are either higher and if it's a young adolescent or pre-adolescent female if they're out of alignment, their bodies are already starting to twist. So children, so easy to take care of. They respond so fast and such a good time to do it so that they're building on a solid platform. We'll be talking with you again soon.